The uh, investigation has been completed. I do have the report, but um, you know, I, I'm not at liberty to uh, divulge the uh, uh, information in that report because it is a personnel matter. Port Deputy General Manager Felix Pangolinan says more than a week after videos and pictures were sent to KUAM showing port police officers sleeping while at work, the investigation is now complete. Pangolinan could not say whether they were sleeping on duty, but confirms all four officers shown in the footage remain employed at the port. Appropriate actions will be taken against this officer. Sources, however, tell KUAM the officers were in fact sleeping while on the clock. So what kind of personal action may be taken? Pangolinan says under the port's rules and regs, there is a provision under performance that speaks to sleeping on duty. Sleeping on duty um, where life and property is in danger is a violation of the personnel rules and regulations. Uh, the first offense, uh, minimum uh, punishment that can be given to an employee for first offense is uh, uh, a letter of reprimand. The maximum is suspension. For a second offense, the minimum is suspension and the maximum is dismissal. In the meantime, a second investigation has been launched into the person or persons who actually took the pictures of the officers. The port is taking this very seriously because um, uh, if you look at, you know, the pictures and the videos that, that uh, were shown, um, it constitutes a breach of security. Pangolina was once a security guard at the port and says he understands how tiring it can be to stand double and sometimes triple watches. He, however, says it is never an excuse to sleep on the job. He once again ensures the public that security at the port was never compromised. I'd like the public to know that um, at no time was, was the uh, Port Authority uh, uh, security or safety uh, was in jeopardy. And while the port currently experiences a shortage of port police, Pangolinan says that may change very soon. We're going through a mid-year uh, budget review and uh, if the, when, when the chief uh, uh, his division comes up for their review, um, she, she may be requesting for more officers to, to be hired. Pangolinan is giving the port chief of police a week to conduct the second investigation. As for the first, he will be forwarding a recommendation on how to handle the cases to the general manager later this week. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Ken Quintaniza.